She goes her own way, like I don't give a damn, girl. And my God, she owns it. So many heartbreaks, goes back to 2014, and I think that she knows it. She found out it was here by myself. Well, good thing she won't find out. Now, uh, let's see. She said she was at the hotel right across the street from the Oh, there we go. I'll see you in a minute. See ya! <sighs> Mind if I join? Uh, not at all! <laughs> Come on in! <laughs> what floor? Four, please. Hey, you look kind of familiar. Uh, do you go to Eiko High? Y yeah. Are you Azumi? Y yeah, that's me. <laughs> You're Kenji, right? Yeah, surprised you knew my name. I mean... Same. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> this one's me. Uh, see you around, Kenji. Uh, have fun at the con tomorrow. Yeah, see you around. Hopefully, we'll run into each other tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. <laughs> Okay, wait. Oh, oh, gotta stay cool. Gotta stay cool. Oh, gotta tell Mako. On, right? Wait, you guys were in the elevator together? <gasps> were you guys alone? Yes! Oh my god, what happened? So basically, Kenji entered after I did and she recognized me from school! She even knew my name! Ah! Oh 
my god, oh my god. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Before we continue, you need food in you. I grabbed some bento boxes from the convenience store next door for us to eat. Aw, thanks, Mako. Of course. Now, why haven't you made a move on Kenji at school yet? Well, to be honest, I... I don't want to hide nor admit that I'm a fan of her online and stuff. I don't want her to feel weird about it, you know? Okay, that's fair. I'd feel guilty hiding it, but on the other hand, if I told her, I'm, I'm worried I'd scare her away. I mean, how do you just say, Hi, I've been watching you online for years and know more about you than most people do, <laughs> without sounding like a freaking stalker! Hmm, that's rough, buddy. You're telling me. Well, you obviously don't want to lie when you're starting a relationship with her. Of course not. It was just so nice talking to her in the elevator. What did you talk about in the elevator? When did you get sunglasses? Oh, I always have them in case of an emergency. Okay. Thank you again for grabbing me food, Mako. I really needed it after that date with Zenshin failed so horribly. No worries. I also got you a toothbrush and toothpaste from the store, too. And you can wear some of my pajamas if you'd like. Thank you so much, Mako. You're genuinely one of the sweetest people I know. I'm so glad we became friends. Besides Denki, I don't really have anyone in person till I met you. Thanks for being my friend, Mako. Aw, I'm so glad we became friends, too. I felt so alone at school before. I would just count the minutes until I would go home and talk to my friends online. And don't get me wrong, I still hang out with those friends all the time, and they're some of my closest friends, but... It's so nice having someone to hang out with in person, too. Someone who gets me and my interest and cares about me. Thank you, Azumi. Miko, you're gonna make me cry! Don't cry. If you cry, I'm gonna cry too, Izumi. <laughs> I just love you so much. Shut up. I love you so much. <laughs>